um, what's news? Hey, good night. Uh, good night, good Mrs. Night. Hello. Good evening. It's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure what's to have news? You. Oh, oh, well, I'm a little bit mentally fatigated. <laughs> uh, me, nothing in special, but I'm very happy. <laughs> me too. I'm so happy. Yeah. But I, okay, I think I have, I have used my, my, my brain a lot today. <laughs> uh -huh, your brain? Yes, a lot. Uh, what happened? Well, I've been studying um, since 9 a.m. in the morning until 1.30 p.m. Are you studying right now? Yes. The, I, oh. Then I have to, when I had my lunch, and uh, I retake my uh, study around 3 to 4, and I finish at 4. Other career? No, actually, um, because I am an interpreter, so I need to study a lot uh, about um, ethics, about being a court, for example, of ethics and medical. So I was studying basically medical, legal, business, and immigration vocabulary. Oh, interesting. And uh, yeah. also, interesting. Um, yeah, interesting. To develop skills about side, consecutive, uh, telephonic, and simultaneously trans uh, translation. Because they're totally well, Congratulations, teacher. You're very happy. You're, you're a great teacher. Uh, but you cannot imagine. I'm exhausted. Because there's a lot of things. From uh, like a simple uh, text and terminology until like, what's going on what's that yeah. and say what because there's sometimes there's a specific terminology especially in legal things and medical then i'm like oh my god what's that because i'm not i'm not a doctor right and i'm not a lawyer so as as in spanish there's own terminology just if you study that um career you know that but if you don't <laughs> so so i you need to i need to be in the same page so I, at least i need to know like um some terminology about a specific subject, because if not, uh, my interpretation will be like weak, right? Mm -hmm. And I need to translate the exactly the, the same did, meaning. Did you live in United States? No, I have been there from vacation, but I haven't lived there. I don't like it. Ah, but but uh, you are speaking as well as American people. Well, because as, as I was letting you know, the beginning of the model, I've been listening in English since I was three years old. So ah, basically, yes. it's my second language. I have a classmate, and she is speaking English as well as you do. Really? Very okay. fast. Very fast, uh, her, I know. Her name is Claudia, uh, Claudia Marroquin, but okay. I... I have a, another classmate with a, with the same name, but mm -hmm. she isn't. Okay, because <laughs> uh, she doesn't yeah. speak like that. Okay, yeah, and as as well, that's why I'm learning a lot of things. So, oof. Julissa speaks so fast too. Yeah, sure. Julissa speaks <laughs> fast, and all the yes. tips and everything that I'm learning. Julissa. I'm trying to also transmit it to you. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm. That's what we're doing. All the uh, listening exercises and speaking exercises, basically the listening exercises, is 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 really important. So yeah. all the things that I'm learning right now, I'm transmitted to you because you need to also learn that as well. Yeah. Hey, Anita, Anita called me. Uh, she she cannot uh, to be in she, class. She won't be able to be in she the class. Okay. Okay, no problem. I'm going to uh, send her a message later on. Okay. Okay, Carlos. Hi. How are you? Sure. Uh, hey. I'm fine. No, I'm now fine. before something happens, I'm going to present whiskey. Okay. Because okay. I remember that yesterday. <laughs> today um, is the day. <laughs> yeah. Now they are. I think they are still here in the, at home. So allow me just a couple of minutes, and I'll be right back with you guys. Okay. Someone knows when this curse ends? I yeah, think. next week. <laughs> oh, next week? Yes. Okay. I, just, I was wondering if it was this like well, today, tonight? or uh, next week. No, it was this week. Okay, let me just a couple of minutes. I think whiskey is working right now. Come on. Stop. All right. Whoa. No, let me just... <laughs> it's breaking. You're in a tiger. 
<laughs> wow. It's a lion. <laughs> Did you work this day, Julissa? Uh, no, I didn't. I worked for a while. Oh, look at the whiskey. Look at the dog. Whiskey. What happened with the whiskey? Okay, this Looks is my so dog. All right, it is exactly like Carlos' dog, actually. You see? The dog. Yeah. I like the dog. Whiskey is a combination <laughs> between terrier and a schnauzer. Let me just I have name. So you can what see is his, his face. name? His name is Whiskey. Whiskey. Ah. And look, he has whiskey. a big ear. Yes, I understand. Uh, he's my baby. Okay, now this is my baby. Yes, a pretty baby. But I do have also a, um, I can say basically a grandson, a dog grandson, and his name is Chestnut. Look at him. Oh. I, I like oh. it so much. I like it. Oh, oh my God. You see? It's a <laughs> okay, it's look pretty. at his eyes. He has a green eyes, actually. Okay, this is Chestnut, by the way. <laughs> All right. A dog. A doggy, I think he's lovely, doggy, right? Yeah. Pretty. It's oh my so God. adorable. Yeah, he's only five months. I right like now. it. Oh. oh. It's a puppy. Ooh, I puppy. have cats. I it's have a puppy, yeah. Cats. Okay, so you already know my babies. Mr. Chestnut and Mr. Whiskey. Chestnut. <laughs> Chestnut. Okay, Chestnut, because that means in Spanish, the seed that the squirrel, the squirrels, it's... Oh, that is in Spanish, yeah. chestnut. No, it's chestnut. chestnut. Oh. Yes. And because of the color of his hair, because he's a combination between light brown and dark brown. So that's, yeah. that's why I ask, I call, I name him chestnut. <laughs> they don't understand in English. <laughs> don't worry. Okay, cool. Okay, he already left because if not, it will be in trouble. <laughs> okay, no, I said, uh, Madeline, that. The, do you remember chestnut uh, hair color? He's like a light brown, almost like yellow. So yes. because of the combination Hello. between his hair, the body hair and the, and, the, and the ears, ears are like darker, like a brown, dark brown. So that's why I call him name, or name him chestnut, nuez, like the color of that. Hmm. Yeah, my mama called him uh, Toffee, or so, um, little bird, because he's like a bird, right? Because he's hairy, and um, he's 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 okay. He understands her. <laughs> nice. You, you you like him? Yeah. Yeah. I like him like yeah. being you. I can I can love a dog. Yeah. You told me that you don't like animals. I love them. It looks good with you. I, yes, I, I love them. I cannot see a cat or a dog without hugging, hugging them. I can't. Basically, I love them. Nice. Yes, I wish I could have a farm. Wow. So <laughs> I can have a really lot of animals. Yeah. Close. So I can have a lot. I love animals. And I don't know, I think they hang up well uh, yeah, with me. Me too. Me too. Yeah, I, I love animals. I love a lot of them, especially I, I love snakes. I love parrots. Me too. I love parrots. Yeah, Maria, I love ah. snakes. I love the, the color. The color are really amazing. And also the, the texture of the skin. Oof. Like the snake style, like printed in the in the clothes? Mm-hmm. As well. Like it's really nice. Yes. I love them. I love them. I also I love no. crocodiles as well. Yeah. Maria. You know what? I, I had experience with a lot of um, animals. Basically, I when I was in Miami, I went to like the Sea World, and I also took a picture with a with a with a with a seal with a foca. Uh, uh. Yep. And um, also, I almost was like a little bit like this close to swim with the dolphins. Yes. But the time that I arrived there, there was like a, a school for a special kids that use like the dolphins for therapy. So basically I couldn't because I said no, because today this is a therapy for the children. So you are not able to. Okay. But I also, I've been like here close to, um, to a whale, to Shamu, like Shamu, uh, to the, um, 
how you say that in Spanish? Uh, ballena asesina, killer whale. Oh. Ah, yeah. Yes. Yes. Actually, I have been whipped. Well. Yes. Yes, it's really nice. I, I, and also, and also, what else? I don't dolphins. Dolphin. Yes, I love dolphins. Do you like dolphins? Yes, I do. Actually, the, I have like five favorite animals, and uh, that was like um, like a question mark for my for my husband because each animal represents part of my uh, characteristics. <laughs> so, like you know, oh. this guy. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. I love the a penguin. lion. I like a lion and tiger. And tiger. Wow. So are, are my favorite <laughs> animals. Definitely. Oh yeah, they are tiger. beautiful. Tiger. I like it so They much. are beautiful. <laughs> I wish I could yeah. hug one, but right now no, because I will be his dinner. Don't want to wait. <laughs> All righty, guys. So tell me something. But any chance that you do your homework? Yes, I did. Oh, yeah. That's amazing. Yes I, did. yes, I did. That's why I love you. Homework. Because you, yes, hunger, Mr. Osman, because I know that you are so, so responsible. All right. One of the hungers basically was to have like five words for uh, clusters, right? Counts and yes. clusters. Yes. A, T, M, R. Yeah. All right. I phone. I phone. Mm. I phone. Let me double check. Some, some words. Aha, uh -huh. yes, but don't cheat. I'm <laughs> just kidding. All righty. Okay, who can help me? Okay, I, Osman, did you do your homework? Um, the true, no, no, teacher. No, you, you, look, you look tired today. True. Uh, yes, a lot. <laughs> what happened? Uh, I, I was working a lot in my house now. Oh. Okay. Uh, because my my boss uh, uh, asked me, asked me uh, a lot of things, and okay. he 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 told me uh, I had to work. Yes, and I also uh, yesterday I, I can't sleep. I, I didn't sleep. You couldn't uh, sleep well. I couldn't sleep well. Uh, yesterday I fell asleep at five a.m. Wow, so well, you slept today well, in the morning. Oh, oh you. Uh, today. Mm. I, I, today, I, I, early, I, early morning. Yes, I, I, oh. uh, I first slept 5 a.m. and then go, go my, uh, went, went, my bed, went to my bed mm -hmm. and, and sleep uh, only three hours. Oh, and so then, that's and the then, reason. And, and then following working. Oh, my God. So that's why, because th that is not the Osman that we used to know with a lot of mm -hmm. energy and smiling. So like, what's going on with us? Teacher, but, but, but I have problem to fall asleep. I, I, I don't know why, but uh, two months ago, I, I, I can't fall asleep. I can't I sleep couldn't. very well. I couldn't. Maybe you're under well. too much why? pressure? Uh, uh, maybe I feel stress. Stress, yes. Stress. Yeah. Any for, advice, guys, for, for him? For, maybe, for, maybe. for situation, for situation, mm -hmm. teacher. Yes. Maybe you, you could try uh, swallowing um, melatonin before sleep. Really? It's good. Yeah, it's really good. And it's natural. My husband has that, that same issue, and he, he swallows one or two with water um, before going to bed, and then he sleeps all night. Really? Uh, Julissa, can, can you send what me is a, the name? A, a, a message? It's made this medicine, please. Sure, I will. Um, yeah, I will. And because also I, maybe I, I, a screenshot, right? Sure. I need a lot. Yes, maybe I could, I could show you the, like the bottle once. Oh, yes, of course. Oh, okay, you know what? She was, she was on the on her bed, by the way. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could be her. <laughs> All right. She's in bed. Yeah. She is in she's bed. in bed. Oh. Okay, oh so God. she said, okay, oh, you see? Osman. There you go. Uh, melatonin. Okay, but, uh, don't, don't move, please. Don't, don't move. Please, I, I, melatonin. I don't, oh. don't, don't move, don't move, please. Don't move. I think I already uh, took a screenshot. Let me do Yes. Okay. 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 Thanks. I'm going, I, I go. Uh, I'm going to buy this medicine. Sure. 
Yes, that would be really nice. That will help you a lot. I have a big problem with that. I can't sleep. I think you're not the only one. Also, a cup of tea will be good. Sure. Yeah, like a chamomile tea, right? Like a lettuce tea, a hot milk, if you're lactose free. Um, I, how you say that? There's another verb, herbs, right? That you can mix and go to sleep. Yes. Yeah, but that's nice. Hopefully you can uh, sleep well today, Mr. Osmond. First of all. <laughs> yeah. But I'm so, you know, even though it has been a hard day for you, um, but I'm so happy that you're here because it shows your commitment. So don't worry about it, right? As, okay. as long as you're here, I'm happy. Okay? <laughs> no, I know, okay. guys. You know, that, that's why, uh, well, our creator, help, uh, well, create us basically with a necessity to sleep. Because it's like uh, we need to recharge our batteries, right? And if we do not sleep, it, that we're not good the rest of the day. Well, That's true. We need to sleep. We need to recharge our batteries. Exactly. So I understand. But I'm so happy that you're here. So don't worry, okay? It's don't like worry. a Limbitrol. It's exactly. like a Limbitrol other medicine. Mm -hmm. Exactly. All righty. So let me listen to Julie. Julie, did you make your homework? Yes, I did. Okay, cool. Let's listen to you. So, um, with K. Yeah. Should I read? Yeah, one? yeah of course. We're listening to you. Books, uh, skate, back, lucky, skip, score. Mm -hmm. Very good. With, with T as, as in tomato. As in tomato, right? Go ahead. Stuck, sept. Accept. Mm -hmm. The first one was accept, and the next one is accept. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, exactly. Mm -hmm. Amount. With M, as in mom. All right. The first one is form. Mm -hmm. Camp. Ramp. Triumph. Empty. With N, it's no. Month. Font. Behind. Friend with P, spray, space, spli, spleas, or splies, spleas. I think it's a spleas, spot, accept. Mm -hmm. With R, bring, drunk, distribute, attract, group. With L, please, flag, close, mm -hmm. exclusive and slim mm -hmm. that's good the only thing that i'm not agree with is with empty empty why the because m and the p and the t yeah but uh, in, in, yeah but it starts with a vowel oh. and usually the clusters are the first two letters of the word oh okay so, so the, yeah F shouldn't be one as well mm -hmm. Yes. Exclusive, all the ones with the vowel wouldn't mm -hmm. be no oh. because basically just they are consonant clusters so most of the time there are stars at the beginning of the world okay i and thought it would be like in the middle of the world or at the end no it has to like, be in the start mm -hmm. okay. like for example if you can double check the example all of them are started with a with a with a consonant all of them yeah, yeah. but they're, but most of them are really good actually Especially the one with S. Very okay. good. Excellent. No, but good job. I'm so proud of you. Let's clap here. <laughs> Let's clap because you also made a really good job, actually. And thank you so much for taking the time to double check it. Excellent. Who else? Arturo, go ahead. Thank you. What? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hi. How are you? Okay, cool. Let's listen to I'm you, sir. Fine. Okay. Yeah, let's begin with the letter. There are D. All right. Okay. Drink. Mm -hmm. No, but uh, I'm sorry. With okay. the letter K. K. Okay, drink. reload. Okay, good. <laughs> Nothing happens. Okay. okay, cool. Drink. Milk. Thanks. Uh, then with the letter T. Mm -hmm. Taste. Step. Stop. With the letter M. Mom. Form. Game, mother, with the letter N, noun, and name. 
with the letter with the letter P. Past, picture, paper, pencil. With the letter R. Roar, raid, R, pride. With the letter L. Lemon, telephone, cell phone, and fly. All right. Uh, yeah, it's good. But the same that happens to Julie. The, uh, yeah, the most of the words are like the consonant and the vowel, and it has to be two consonants. Two okay, consonants okay. At, the, at the beginning of the word that has that sound in particular. Mm -hmm. But that's good. Great. Good try. Great. So yeah. now you know. Very good. A good. Yes, Thank you, hear me? yes, I can hear you. There you go. Who else? Omar. But good job, Arturo. Omar, what about you, can sir? You hear me? Can I hear me? Yes. No, no responde. Yes, we can hear you. I can you listen to me? Okay. Yes, we can hear you. Okay, well, I'm going to start with K. Skin. Sketch. School. Sky. Skill. Mm -hmm. With T. Stable. Mm -hmm. Stack, stadium, mm -hmm. student, mm -hmm. stick, with M, smile, small, smoke, smoke, smart, with N, snorkel, sniff, <laughs> sniper, snow, snaker, with B, Space, special, spice, spy, with R, pray, present, project, grace, Greek, with L, plaza, glacier, I think that is, I, I don't know how do you say, it. glacier? Uh, gl glacier, yeah. Okay. A flavor, clap and blow. All righty, very good. So I'm going to send it to you right now, guys, through the chat, so you will be able. You see, Julie? Okay, we have small. We have you see? We have S M together, right? We have small. We have S M together. A smoke, present, P R. You see? Even though it has a vowel, but the two consonants are what are their clusters. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm so it's very good. Excellent job, Mr. Omer. Any anybody else? Maria? Yes. Uh, oh, the this, last one. Is this similar to Julissa? Okay, that's and, good. But I find you found for example T. Uh-huh. T. Stop. Mm. Strange. Okay. Strike. It's two. Mm -hmm. And letter N. Yeah. Uh, Nif, mm -hmm. nose, snake. Oh, this one, yes, okay. Um, um, R, train, track, mm. treasure, travel, travel. Yeah, that's good. K, club, <laughs> coach, cake. Mm -hmm. Uh, this is our vocabulary. Yes. And letter P uh, is the similar paint, page, pope. I know. Because uh -huh. I, that letter P is one of the most hardest one to find. Okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, I, you're talking about clusters, right? Because there's a lot yes. of words with P, but clusters, yeah, they're really hard to find. So that, do you remember that I told you that would be one of two that you will have trouble with? Yeah, and that's the one. But that's okay. Good job. Okay, okay. I, I already sent it again. You have stop. You said stop. Strange snake train pressure mm. travel club. Yeah, you got T L. You have T R T S N T R T R. This is good. Very good. Those are clusters. Excellent job. All right. Who else was a really good student and did the homework? Brian, Mr. Francisco, Gerardo, oh my god, yeah, very good, let's hear you girl, sorry ma'am, may I apologize? Okay teacher, uh, with K, okay. uh, skill, mm -hmm. skin, mm -hmm. skip, skirt, 
All right. Sky. Very good. With T, uh, step, stick, stuff, mm -hmm. steam, stage. Uh, with M, uh, smell, smash, smile, smart, smoke. Uh, with N, mm -hmm. snake, sneaker, mm -hmm. snow, mm -hmm. snap, snail. Very good. With P, uh, speak, speech, spell, spider, spirit. Right. With with our uh, brain, mm -hmm. rose, brush, uh, breath, a bright. Right, very good. And, and with L, uh, slow, a uh, slum, blind, a uh, sleep, uh, plant. All right, very good. Excellent job. That was really good. Really good. There you go. Thank you. Excellent job. Okay, so you know, Julie, Maria, and Arturo, you have like a better idea how they are, right? Okay, very good, excellent job. Okay, anybody else? Patty, uh, Claudi, Iris, no. Carlitos. Hi, teacher. Hi, teacher. Hey. I'm, I'm Pat. <laughs> I need the homework today. <laughs> okay, don't worry. Okay, who, who also made your housework? Patty? Did yes, okay, yes, I cool. am. We're well, listening to you, girl. Go ahead. Yeah. Teacher, I make two consonants. Oh, and that's okay. Cam, campus, two words only. And dance, danger, C, factor, factory, key, K, take, Take off. Mm -hmm. L. Sales. Salt. And bank. Banker. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Good for your searching. But also that happens exactly the same with Julie and Arturo. That the words have, uh, you, you, you use a consonant in bubbles, in vowels, right? Bank, for example. And uh, it has to be two vowel, two consonants. But that's good. Two consonants. Two oh, consonants. Okay. Two consonants at the beginning of the world. Okay. Like, like the one that I sent it right now to you guys in the chat. So those are examples. Okay, so that's those are clusters. Okay. Don't, don't okay. worry, okay? We're learning, but that's good. That's good. It, it's, it's not only because they sound like the K or they sound like P or R. It's also they have to have the two consonants at the beginning of the world. So you can be like a consonant cluster. Mm -hmm. All right, so hey, we're good I, on that. It's yes. the word, it's the word, mm -hmm. it's the word, two balls mm -hmm. and consonant. Mm -hmm. Yes, for example, the one that I sent it to you right now is smile. Like this? Smile. You have S, yes. M, I, L, E. I, L, E. Exactly, so it's a cluster because you have the two consonant, S and M, together. At the beginning of the world. Ah. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. I understand. Okay, cool. <laughs> Very good. Excellent. What about the, the sec no, part number two of your homework? About the dialogue. Did you do that? Yes. Simple pass and, uh, okay. There you go. So let's double check it. Okay. Allow me just a couple of minutes. Let me pop it up right now on my screen. And then we can share it, okay, together. Because I want you guys to let me know about that. Okay, we're going to do it together. And I have the answers, by the way. Okay, so, okay, let me open it here really quickly. And let me share it right now on my screen. There you go. That was the second uh, part of the, of the hunger, right? Okay, guys, cool. Tell me, what is the... Uh, letter B on number one dialogue. What is the right answer for that? Mm -hmm. The Can right answer is I. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. All right. And the second one. I have. I have. I had. 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 I had. All right. And the other one. Cook. Cook. 
Cook. C-O-O-K-E-D? Cooked? Yes. Cooked. C-O-O-K-E-D. So cooked. All sure. right. Very good. What about number two? Go ahead. Tried. 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 Oh, tried. Okay. Like tried. that, guys? T R no no, no. no. it's ah, wrong. It's e R I I I E D. -E -D. Very good, excellent. Perfect. What about the answer? No, I no, I haven't. You haven't. Oh, I have not exactly. Very good. But I would like to. Okay, cool. What about number three? How did you have? Yeah, uh, leave it like that way, right? Because you have the yes, use that the auxiliary did. Okay, what about the answer? Yes, I did. Yes, I, did. yes, I have. Yes, I, have. I did. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Yes, yeah, I did. very good. Excellent. Or, I? Eight. I ate. I ate. Eight. Eight. Very eight. good. Very good. What about number four? I've eaten. I, I've eaten. 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 Like that? E A T E N. Very yes. good. Yes. Or good. Yes, I have. Oh, yes, exactly. Very yes, good. I have. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Okay, in fact, eight. I eight. 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 Eight some. Very good. What about number five? Drink. 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 Like Drink. that way, right? We leave it like that way. Okay, yes. cool. All right, what about the other one? Another one? Yes, I did, right? Yes, I did. 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 All right, yes, I did. and uh, the second part? I Hell. I have. Had. 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 Very good. Had. Had. Okay, cool. So let's practice. Uh, we have five dialogues, mini dialogues. So let's practice them. Okay, I want dialogue number one, Mr. Arturo and Iris. Go ahead. Okay, I'm number eight. Yes. Have you ever been to picnic at the beach? Yes, I have. My family and I had a picnic on the beach last month. We cooked hamburgers. Yeah, very good. Hamburgers. Excellent. Lyola number two. Um, I think it's going to be Mr. Omar and uh, Patricia. Have you ever tried to shoot? No, I have. But what? I like to. Okay, very good. That was easy, right? Okay, so you will continue with number three as well. Okay. <laughs> did you have breakfast today? Yes, I did. I ate a cook breakfast. Very good. A huge breakfast. A huge, huge breakfast. Huge. Yes. That means huge. that you ate scrambled eggs, french fries, you know, fried banana, cocktail of fruits, Coffee, tortillas, sweet bread, etc. That was a huge bread breakfast. Okay, number four, and uh, Mr. Osman and um, Madeline. Okay, uh, have you ever eaten Mexican food? Where is Madeline? Madeline, where are you? I don't know. I think she got lost. Okay, don't worry. What about Claudita? Okay. Yes, I have. In fact, I ate some just last week. Very good. And finish with the number five, please, both of you as well. Did you drink coffee this morning? Yes, I did. I had had some on my way to work. Very good. Excellent, boy. Not too bad. Very good. Excellent job. So you see, it's really nice, right? Because you make you yes. practice. You practice and using both of the of the tenses, and um, present perfect and uh, simple past. Mm -hmm. And if you can see, guys, you can use both of them as long as you know how to use it and and which is what you're talking about. There will be no problem at all. Do you think that do you understand the difference between simple past and present perfect? Is it oh, clear? Yes. yes. Yeah. Right. Yes. Of course, yours really smart. So it's like easy peasy queasy. I know that. It's like a piece of cake for you. Yeah. All right, cool. So now, guys, uh, we already start with this. And let's talk about cooking methods. Can you see my screen right now? Yes. Yes. Yeah? yes. Okay, guys. So we have a different type of cooking methods. We have bake, 
for example, hornear, which is used when we bake a cake, oh. for example. We have boil, right? Yeah. Like in Baño Maria, right? We have fried, like bananas, right? Or eggs. <laughs> we have grill, when you go to and you do like a barbecue, yes. right? Yes. Yeah. All right. We got roasted, like chicken, right? Oh, that's amazing. Like, for Roaster. example, uh, pollos reales, a roasted chicken, right? Yeah. And a steam. I think this one is going to be new for you, steam. That one, guys, or, yes, like it's, it's like a vapor. Water. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Basically, I think the, the Chinese people, right? Cook like that. I like. Yeah. I like so, so tell me, guys, how do you cook your food? Could you please be so kind to let me know uh, which method of cook do you prefer? For example, let's take a look, guys. Here, if you can see on my right, on my left side here, we have the methods, right? of cooking we have bake boil fry grill roast and steam and here at the top we have the food we have fish shrimp eggs chicken beef potatoes onions eggplant that means that what you know what eggplants is yes yes all yeah. right exactly i love them all righty so okay so so tell me guys bake okay the fish how you prepare fish? What will be the method? Right. Uh, yeah. Fried. Right. Fried is Fried. one of them. Fried. There's another way that you can Fried. make a fish. Grill. Yes. Grill. Bake. 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 Oh, yeah. Bake. Yeah. This is good, too. Mm -hmm. Bake is really good. good. Too. What else? Can you boil it? Al, al no. Um, al steam. Oh, steam. 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 Yeah. Oh. <laughs> can you roast it? No, right? No. No. Okay. No. Okay. What about shrimp? Fry, grill, grill, very good. What about eggs? Fry, fry, of course. Boil, boil. what boil. else? Boil, bake. You can also bake. steam it, right? Yes, yes. Can, bake. You, can you bake an egg? No, no, or make a cake? The microwave, no, 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 no. but but uh, yes, but I mean, just the eggs. Um, yeah, okay, okay. Of course not, all right. <laughs> yes, when you make a cake, you need to add the, the eggs on the on the cake preparation, the mixture, but not the cake, the, the eggs itself. All right, what about chicken? Bake every day. Oh my God. Bake this is gross. Yeah. This is like a versatile food, right? A versatile meal. That yes. You can basically you can use all the methods. Yeah. Yes. What about, yeah. What about the beef? Um, real. 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 Yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, Fry. Grill. Grill. Yeah. Can you steam it? Roast. Yeah. Roast. Roasted? No, right? Steam. No. 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 Grill. 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 What about oh, beef? You said beef. It can bake. It can be baked, fried, grill, and steam. All right. What about potatoes? Uh, bake. Bake. Oil. Fried. Grill. Grill. And steam. Thin. Thin. I think you can do it, everything, right? Okay. Yes. What about onions? No. Fried oil. Fried oil. Oil, yeah. Fried. Fried. Grill. 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 You can fry it. Fry. You can grill it. You can boil it. Like wow. Yeah. Uh, Roasted. Steam. 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 Yeah. Steam. And what about bananas? Fry. Fry. Fry boil. bananas. Bake. 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 Boil. Grill. Bake. Bake. I think you can do a lot of all of them, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. That is a food. So basically, guys, which of the food that we are already talking about you can use? Any kind of Excellent. method. Which one? Chicken. Chicken. And what else? Eggplant. Eggplant and potatoes. Potato. 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 No, eggplant, no. Potato. I know eggplant, no. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, what about, there is a one food that you can use only three of methods of cooking? 
Shrimp. 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 According to what I have, what we have done right now, what's your favorite way to cook or eat the food? In part A, for example, Maria, what is your favorite way to cook it or eat it? Bake. Bake. All for right. me, it's bake. For yes. Bake. And what about you, Arturo? I think steam and boil. And boil. What about you, Mr. Osman? Uh, steam and boil and grill. Very good. What about you, Alberto? Uh, like Osman, fry, steam, and grill. All right, very good. Fry and steam. Very good. What about you, Brian? Fry, bake, and boil. Very good. What about you, Carlos? Well, in my house, we don't eat fish <laughs> because okay. my wife is allergic. Ah, okay, so okay, that, that's another thing. But uh, fry is good. All right, very good. What about you, Gerardo? Uh, fry, grill, and bake. Excellent. What about you, Mr. Omer? Bake, boil, fry, grill, and steam. Very good. Almost all, everything. Okay. Patty, what about you? Bake, fry, grill, only. Very good. Okay, what about you, uh, Raul? Raul is not here. What about you, uh, Francisco Mahano? Uh, what was the question? Uh, what is the, what's your favorite way to cook or eat the foods in part A, the one that we have seen right now? Uh, yeah, I like fried eggs um, mm -hmm. and also have fried meat mm -hmm. and grilled meat, mm -hmm. mm, steamed potatoes. All righty. Mm, what else? Oh, I like. Oh. Well, I like to fry everything. <laughs> okay, yes, it's really good. Fried things are really nice. Lydia and Jose, what about you guys? Jose, are you here with us? Or Mr. Enio? No, they're not here. Okay. Madeline, what about you? And boy, I'm fried. Well done fried. Okay, cool. Excellent. So you see, guys, maybe there are some methods that you already know, right? But there are some new methods for you. Is that correct? Oh, I like bake. Oh, Julie, may I apologize. Boil, <laughs> grill, and steam. Basically all of them, right? No, I don't fry. That's you don't not. fry? Okay. Is for a healthy problem? Um, yes, to yeah, to take care of our body weight. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, you're right. Yes. But the, I love uh, fried. Me too. But uh, Francisco Mahano said, oh my God, a fried chicken. That's amazing sometimes, right? Yes. Yeah, I know. Yeah, they're really nice. So sometimes you need fried things, guys, but not every single day, okay? Because maybe you will have a heart attack after that. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, because your corons will be stuck. All right. Okay, very good, but they're really delicious. Everything is really good. As, as long as you can cook as healthy as possible, that will be amazing. Okay, tell me guys, have you ever steamed a fish? No. No? No? I don't buy fish because I don't like the smell. Ah, okay, okay. Not even um, a piece but of that? in a restaurant, yes. <laughs> ah, ah, okay. Like, so, you, so you don't like to prepare, like but fish. you like to eat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's good. That's a good. Okay, thank you. That's good. All right, very good, guys. So now, let me introduce you to Mr. Um, Elvis Presley's favorite sandwich. Peanut what? butter and banana. Yeah. You know what? That's wow. delicious. That's really yes. delicious. It's delicious. Yes. It's amazing. Butter and banana. Yeah. It's delicious. Yeah. yeah. That combination is amazing. So thank you, guys. Do you think that this is a healthy amazing. snack? What yes, it's a healthy. It's a healthy Okay, cool. All righty. So, peanut butter and banana. Okay, let's listen right now. I'm going to play right now the audio because I want you guys to pay attention to the pronunciation. 
of, mm -hmm. for example, it's not everybody who loves to cook, right? And you go to the recipes to also that everything that you prepared is delicious, but also has a good taste. So it's really important to follow the instructions. So right now, guys, let me click right now on my screen and listen to uh, the pronunciation of these um, instructions for cooking. Okay, tell me if you can hear it, please. Page 25. Can you hear it? Can everybody listen to the information? Yes. Okay, yes. Cool. cool. Yes. That's what I want. All right, cool. So let me just another a couple of minutes. There you go. Five, exercise nine, perspectives. Family cookbook, part A. Listen to this recipe for Elvis Presley's favorite sandwich. Do you think this is a healthy snack? Peanut butter and banana. Three tablespoons peanut butter. One banana, mashed. Two slices of bread. Two tablespoons butter, melted. First, mix the peanut butter and mashed banana together. Then, lightly toast the slices of bread. Next, spread the peanut butter and banana mixture on the toast. After that, close the sandwich and put it in a pan with melted butter. Finally, fry the bread until it's brown on both sides. All righty, would you like to hear it one more time? Yes. All right. Yeah. Perspectives. Family Cookbook. Part A. Listen to this recipe for Elvis Presley's favorite sandwich. Do you think this is a healthy snack? Peanut butter and banana. Three tablespoons peanut butter. One banana, mashed. Two slices of bread. Two tablespoons butter, melted. First, mix the peanut butter and mashed banana together. Then, lightly toast the slices of bread. Next, spread the peanut butter and banana mixture on the toast. After that, close the sandwich and put it in a pan with melted butter. Finally, fry the bread until it's brown on both sides. All right. So, guys, tell me. It's not healthy. Not uh, healthy. Eh, no, it's not healthy at all. But tell me, oh. guys. Uh, tell me, guys. Sorry. Um. You please be so kind to let me know if you do not understand any words in my vocabulary for you. What's the meaning of tablespoons? Tablespoons. All right. Yeah. I will sh yes, but there is a different type. Tablespoon. Yeah, I will okay. show it to you right now. I will show it to you. All right. All righty. Oh. Okay, these ones. But this one, we have two types of spoons, guys. The one that we use to, 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 add, to add a sugar for a coffee is a small spoon, yeah. right? Okay. Okay. Yes. okay, but the tablespoon is the one that we use to drink the soup, okay? Okay. That's a mm, tablespoon. It's a long. Yes, it's the big it's one. It's a long. It, it, it's the big ones. Okay. No, the, yeah, the little ones we call teaspoon. And the big ones we call tablespoon. Okay. Okay. All right. Any other vocabulary, guys? Mash it. I think. Mash it. Mash it. Mash it. Puré. Puré. Exactly. Puré. Exactly. <laughs> like for example, you prepare the banana to make like empanadas, right? Yeah. yeah. So, so, no, exactly. So it's exactly it's exactly the same texture. Okay. Exactly. Machacada. Okay, Machacada. exactly, exactly. Any other vocabulary, guys? Slices. Slices? All right, I will show it to you. I will show it to you because I want to show it to you. Yeah. That is a slice. One, two, three, four. That is a slice, sir. Slice. Okay. Slice. Okay. Slices. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Very Slice. good. All right. Any other vocabulary, guys? Lightly. Which one? Lightly. Lightly. That means that it's toasted, but not too much. 
Okay. Trust him. Many, uh, Lightly mess- would be like exactly like a little burn, but not like you burn the bread, right? That you cannot yes. eat it. So it, it has like a like a color. The bread has to have like a brown color, slightly brown color. Okay. What else? Melted. Melted. Teaspoon bottle melted. Derretido. Oh. All right. Oh, melted. Or like, for example, like the butter used to come like in a solid, egg, right? That's solid form, right? But melt is like if you put it in a little, um, in the in the iron or in the microwave, so it could be like a little soft, okay? Yeah, yeah, but... exactly. What else, guys? Woo. Any other vocabulary? Teacher, I saw a one word. Uh, yes. The second, the second part. Uh, okay. Put in a pan. Pan. What do you mean the pan? Where is Cacerola. it? Yes, exactly. What? Pan. Sorry. The pan is a casserole. Ah. Yes. Ah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh yes, pan. exactly. Pan. 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 What else? <laughs> no, 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 no. No, I know that you're hungry, but no. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Very good. So we can repeat right now the the information so pro, uh, practice the pronunciation. So repeat after me. Three tablespoons peanut butter. Three tablespoons peanut butter. One banana mashed. One banana mashed. Two slices of bread. Two slices of bread. Two tablespoons butter. Two tablespoons butter. First, 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 mix the peanut butter. Mix the peanut butter and mash banana together. And mash bananas together. together. Then lightly toast the slices of bread. And then lightly toast the slices of bread. Then spread the peanut butter and banana mixture on the toast. Banana mixture on the toast. After that, after that, close the sandwich and put it in a pan with melted butter. Melted butter. Melted butter. Right? And put it. Put it in a pan. Put it in a pan. With a melted butter. With a melted butter. Finally, finally, fry the bed. Fry the bread, the bread. The bread. until it's brown on both sides. Until it's brown on both sides. Both sizes. Both sizes. Both sizes. Both sizes. Both sizes. Both sizes. Very good. Both sizes. Exactly. Both sizes. 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 Remember, both yes, sizes. exactly. Remember both. that TH, guys, is like an S, Z as in zebra. Okay? So it's both. Z, 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 Z. Both. Yes. Both sides. Okay, guys. Take a look at this one. Both. I got, both. we got first, right? We have another first. word. Then, then we have then. next, then. right? Next. All right. Next, have after, after, that, after that, and after that, and we have that, and finally, finally, finally. Finally. Okay, finally. guys. This is really important, especially if you are writing something, because, for example, there is a lot of people that uh, that that repeat the same word, and uh, and uh, and after. And, and again and again and again, right? So uh, mm. we call it in Spanish muletilla, right? Mm. But in order mm. for you guys to sound more fluently, you will need to learn how do we use the adverbs of sequence, adverbio de secuencia, just to providing uh, information about your ideas, but in an order and logic way, okay? So in this case, guys, yep. for example, today, this is really important if you are providing yes. information about, uh, for example, recipe. In this case, a peanut butter, right? Recipe. You see, we have... Fruit. In addition to salad, that, teacher. Yes, but that one is not a numbers of sequence. I will let you know what it is after that. Okay? That's what, mm-hmm. we, call, that what we call in English linking words. Linking words is another thing. 
Okay. We have linking words for the beginning of the conversation, for middle, and for the end. But the ones that I have here, first, then, next, after that, and finally, those calls adverse of sequence. Okay? In addition to? That is an, uh, no, it's not another of sequence. That is a linking word. It's, it's different, Madeline. I will, I will send it to you, yes. the, the links, information about that. So, guys, take a look at the pictures, okay? And I want you guys to help me put it in the correct order, okay? Which one goes first according to the information that we have just read on the recipe, okay, guys? So, tell me, which is the first picture, guys? The four one. The four. The four. The number, number four. four. Number four. All right. Four. Number four. All right. So number this one four. will be number one, right? Okay. I think this is number one. Okay. What about number two? The first the one. First, first one. First, first one. The first, first one. All right. What about number three? Three. Three. The third one. Three. The third one. Remember that is ordinal numbers. Okay. What about number okay. four? The last one. No, no. Or not. Are you sure? No. The second, second one. one. The second one. Second one. Second one. And what about number five? That's the last one, right? Number five, last the last one. It's the last one. All right, cool. Very good, guys. Excellent job. So tell me something. Right now, this is what we're talking about, right? You see? Adverse of frequency or sequence of adverse. We got first. Then, next, after that, and finally. Okay, and we have the example of the peanut butter banana that we have just read. Okay, guys, so this is what we're going to do. Okay, we're going to do an exercise to practice sequence of adverbs, okay? That's what we're going to do right now. And it's going okay. to be, guys, basically Our with friends. the pictures that I have here. You see, we have one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so I want you guys to pay attention to the pictures and as well the announcements that we have here on my left side. And guys, this is how to prepare a kib kibak, kebabs. Have you, have you already tried that? Kebabs? Yes, I have tasted like. uh, a really nice one. Okay, so you need to look at the pictures and number the steps from one to five and then add a sequence of adverbs. So first, guys, we're going to double check the pictures. We already have number one. You see? First, put the charcoal in the grill and light it. So this is the first one. What about number two? Where is it? Which one Four. will be number two? Take a look. Four. Four. Some meat, Then vegetables cook, made, cook up or some meat and, ve and vegetables. Uh -huh. Vegetables. Uh -huh. Which one, guys? Vegetables. Vegetables. Oh, okay. This one, right? All right. Yes. What up, some okay. Your favorite itself. All right. And then what is the sequence of Albert that we need to put? Then, then, right? Then. The meat and, and vegetables then. on the then. key. Then. The what about number three? Keywords. Which is number three? Let's put the, put the meat and, meat and vegetables, vegetables on the keywords. All right, so, vegetables. so tell me, what is the number of frequency that I need to put on number three? Next. 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 Right. Next. Next. Very good. What about number four? Where is it number four? After that. After that. After that. After that. Put the, the, the key 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 on the grill. On the grill. Cook for 10 to 15 minutes. minutes. Oh, okay. So, so after that, guys, will be this one, right? Okay. So tell, yeah. let me just warm up my minutes. So after that will be this one, number four, right? And number five is this one, right? Yes. Finally. yes. Finally. Finally. So I need to change Save this. People. Finally. So this one I need to change it. So it be finally. All right. There you go. So basically that's it. All right. You need, it is number one first. Okay. So let's read it together. Right, guys? Okay, let's, now let's go into practice. Okay. We already identified the adverse of sequence and the numbers. So what's the first one? 
First, 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 first,
how to use the sequence of adverbs. I want you guys to prepare a meal. Okay? Any dish, any dish. You don't have to complicate your life. It could be a scrambled eggs, which is good. It could be a sandwich. It could be a cereal, right? With banana, anything. But you will have it physically in your spot on Monday. And you will need guys to tell us, using the hours of sequency, how you prepare that meal. We will eat together. Yes, it will be fantastic. Don't worry about that. <laughs> or everybody can have a sandwich, but there will be different ways to prepare it, different ingredients, right? So I don't care what you're going to do, but you need to prepare a meal. Okay? Cereal. cereal. Cere yeah, cereal with meal. That would be nice. Or also you can say uh, like a, a bowl of, um, I don't know, um, <laughs> something, a soup. I don't know. I prefer to prepare dessert. Okay, that's nice. You need to use uh, the sequence of hours. So yeah, you can explain it to how you prepare it. Isn't it amazing, your homework? That's nice, right? Yay. Yay. <laughs> we, no. need to, we need to put it in practice in a, lyle, in a lifestyle. And that's the only way that you can put it in practice. And also okay. at the same time, enjoy it. Okay. But put you me a of soap. Yeah, you will enjoy it yourself. Ah, that's not possible. I wish you could share it with everything, with everybody, but no. Okay. <laughs> okay, Francisco, are you happy with that? Yeah. I yeah. Hope so. Hey, please don't buy it, okay? You have to make it. <laughs> <laughs> You don't okay. buy it. Hey, ask for delivery. Hey, China walk. All right. No way. It's, uh, or a hamburger. No way. You got to prepare it. Because you need okay. to let us know how you prepare it. Okay. As okay. I told you guys, it doesn't have to be a complicated meal. No way. Like uh, grilled shrimps with grilled vegetables and a barbecue. I don't, I don't know. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> don't complicate your life. No. It could be a hot dog, okay? I, I'm giving you some ideas, okay? You need to take, you need to write it down, okay? Okay. Chef, Chef Ramsey. Yes, yes, my Mr. Soup. Osman. <laughs> my soup. Yeah, I'm listening to you. Who said teacher, teacher, teacher? Okay. Yes, I heard somebody. Oh, it's my conscience. I don't know. <laughs> All righty. Okay, any questions, guys? Not teacher. I no. don't have any no. No. questions. Everything is no. okay? Okay. Yes, yes. it's okay. Okay, guys, so, like corchata? <laughs> Who said that? Spoon. Alberto, why you said that, sir? Come on. Shame on you. <laughs> I understand. Okay, cool. So, guys, finish the platform for somebody that has not finished it. Hopefully you did, because I want everybody to pass. Okay. Any questions? Some here, or if I have my right hand, you can ask as well. No problem. You know who's my right hand, by the way, right, Julie? Uh -huh. Ah, yes. <laughs> you can answer. No problem about that. Okay. Surprise. <laughs> yeah, or Arturo as well, also. Oh, Omar as well. I have three or more right hands. Okay. <laughs> okay, guys. Hopefully you sleep well, especially you, Osman. Okay. okay. Yes. Hugs and kisses, the dreams. Great weekend, guys. And hopefully we can see you on Monday, okay? Bye-bye. Bye. 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 B